Yeah, my name is Anya, and today I really want to make a South African favorite and a personal favorite of my mom's, Cook Sisters. Cook Sisters are traditionally made of fried dough, which is dunked into ice cold syrup. Today, myself and my mom are going to show you how to make these. So, if you like this video, give it a like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more videos. And don't forget to hit that notification bell to be notified every time I upload. I upload every day, Monday to Friday. My grandmother loves this recipe book. It is in Afrikaans, so I'll translate the recipe into English for my viewers that don't know Afrikaans. Kutu marwa van boterwal was pas getrukt en kon nie juis bak nie. Toe sy in die 50 jaar op hierdie resepie in ons sister tyd skrif Sari afgekom. My kinders vertel vir allemaal hulle maas en koeksisters is die lekkerste wat hulle nog geproe het. Kutu sê, sy verdubbel so met die resep as al die kinders kom keier. Dit is een warm stroopie resep en jy maak die koeksisters binnen in uur as jy eerst die slag ken. In the recipe book, this delicacy is called Kut Cook Sisters. And the reason why it is called it is stated in the summary given above the actual recipe. I'll read it in Afrikaans and then I'll give you a brief summary in English. Kut Amanda van Boerteville is stated in the book that she can't really bake, but she came across a recipe in the sister magazine called Sari and found this Cook Sister recipe. A direct quote from her is given in the book. My children tell everyone that my Cook Sisters are the tastiest that they've ever had. She also said to double the recipe when all her children come and visit. I find that so sweet and I really enjoy learning about the history behind food. Five hundred grams of white sugar, two hundred and fifty mils water, twelve point five mils lemon juice, five mils vanilla essence, two hundred grams flour, twenty two mils baking powder, a pinch of salt, twenty grams butter. 150 mils milk and one bottle of oil to fry your cook sisters in. In a pot of a medium heat, add in 250 mils of water, 500 grams of sugar. My mom likes adding some lemon peel and some roughly chopped up ginger. Mix until the sugar has dissolved. Cook the syrup for 7 to 8 minutes. My mom only adds in half of the required lemon juice. Add in 500 ml of vanilla essence and mix until well combined. Allow to cool completely and remove the lemon and the ginger. Place in the fridge until the syrup is ice cold. In a bowl combine 200 grams of flour, 22 ml baking powder, a pinch of salt, add in 20 grams of butter, and mix until the mixture resembles breadcrumbs. Add 150 ml of milk in two batches. And mix until the dough forms. Roll your dough out. and cut into long strips. Cut three section segments. and braid those three sections. Put 
place it onto a baking tray. I helped my mum braid the dough and it's actually very therapeutic. So it's a great idea to do this with children. And place on the fridge for 30 minutes. Find your cook sisters in hot oil and immediately dump them into your ice cold syrup, which we placed into a bowl with ice and water. This is just to ensure that the syrup stays cold throughout. Enjoy some cook sisters.